we had a vision to create a virtual environment. We didn't know exactly what that would amount to in 2022 as we do now in 2025, but we knew using artificial intelligence, advanced computational design, that we did want to meet the future of retail by creating what amounted to a digital twin. A digital twin is a virtual reality reconstruction of a physical environment that is accurate at a pretty fine level of detail. It's not like a, um, it's not an approximation or an, or an artistic representation of it. It's more like a, an analog of the real world to it. So it's got uh, all the racks in there, the lighting, the windows, the doors, it's all reproduced there. And uh, what's advantageous about it is that the, uh, the students are learning how to digitally scan product and bring that into a virtual reality environment. So there's a transition from a physical retail space into a virtual retail space, which allows them to imagine you know, retail environments of the future, change everything around, put their own ideas artistically. I mean, how much work would it take for a single student to remake an entire physical space, but they can do it virtually and present their ideas. Consumer science, it's everything we gather from what are people buying right now? Why are they buying it? Okay, I'm selling you this. What can I sell you in one week, in one month, in five years? So it's staying with groups and seeing them evolve and how their purchasing behavior evolves. What excites me the most about what this technology can do, it's the potential that we can reach, how we can find new and better ways to connect with our consumers. We've outfitted the space with a series of four sensors that track traffic flow. So we now know where you know, consumers are stopping, what they're looking at, how much time they're spending, what gender they may be to look at goods and services. So we use that original kind of sensor um, information to figure out where we're going to put both physical and virtual merchandise. Students can experience inside of the virtual retail environment so that we can experiment different conditions so that we can give the uh, industry, hey, we have done this, okay, you can take certain advantage from our program. So we can be the leader 